These are the top five cut baits for surf fishing at the beach. Number five, whiting. Whiting is hands down the most underrated fish in the surf. Most surf fishermen target pompano and drum species, but whiting puts up a fantastic fight on light tackle. Whiting makes great cut bait for red drum, black drum, stingray, bluefish, sharks, and many more species. You can either fillet and steak pieces for bait or cut off and use the head for larger species. With all surf fishing rigs, you should use circle hooks to increase your chances at landing fish and to promote healthy catch and release. If you're interested in targeting whiting for cut bait or for food, there are a couple tweaks to your surf fishing gear you can make. I recently sat down with Bama Beach Bum on my podcast and he shared some practical tips for targeting whiting in the surf. The link to that video will be in the description below if you're interested in checking that out. Number four, ladyfish. Also known as skipjack or poor man's tarpon, the ladyfish is another fantastic cut bait for surf fishing. Along the Gulf Coast, you know summer is officially here once the ladyfish start showing up in numbers. These sporty fish put on quite an aerial show once hooked and are a ton of fun if you're looking for some quick action in the surf. They are easy to spot coming down the beach as the surf explodes with action. Ladyfish aren't known for being good table fare, but make excellent cut bait as they are a very bloody fish. As the case with whiting, ladyfish make great cut bait for red drum, black drum, stingray, bluefish, and sharks. Match the size of bait to the species of fish you are targeting and remember to hide the hook in the bait. I found that because they are a very bloody cut bait, you will attract smaller sharks very quickly, especially during summer months. You may have to change out your monofilament leader to steel if you have frequent cutoffs. Number three, mullet. Mullet rank high on my list of go-to cut baits as anyone can pick some up from a local seafood market. Unlike whiting and ladyfish, mullet have very tough scales which help them store well in a freezer for later reuse. Their tough scales and skin make it a great choice for long casts as it easily stays on the hook. Of all the cut bait options, mullet is my choice if I want to target bull drum in the surf. I recommend you use a Carolina rig with a mono or floral leader and a circle hook that matches the size of the bait. You can also use a mullet head with a big circle hook to target sharks and trophy red drum. Check out the video link in the description below for more information about targeting redfish with mullet. Number 2. Shrimp By far the best all-around natural bait for surf fishing is shrimp. You can find shrimp at a local tackle shop, seafood market, or grocery store. Shrimp doesn't hold up too well on the hook after being in a freezer, so try to buy just enough for your trip to the beach. i found the best method of using shrimp is to cut it into two pieces, if it's a large piece, and put it on a double drop pompano rig. Shrimp is absolutely the best natural bait for species variety. Any and all species of fish like shrimp, but that also means you're going to catch the less desirable hardhead catfish. The older and smellier the shrimp, the higher your chances are at catching catfish, so make sure you bring fresh bait to the beach. Before moving on to number one, please consider subscribing to the channel for more surf fishing tips, tricks, and reviews. Number one, fish gum. Fish gum is the only cut bait that combines all the real bait, extract, and synthetic scents and flavors of crab, shrimp, clam, sand flea, and more into one bait. Fish gum comes in a variety of colors, but the scent and flavor are all the same. This bait is so convenient as it lasts up to a year, doesn't require refrigeration, and is hands down the best artificial cut bait I've personally used for surf fishing. You simply take the bait out of the package and cut a piece to put on your hook. Once in the water, the bait begins to dissolve and attract the fish. You can catch all species of fish in the surf with fish gum. There is also a mesh at the center of the bait so it stays on your hook while casting. I recently had Tony Fagioni, the inventor of fish gum, on my podcast and he gave some great insight into why the bait works so well and the struggles he went through to develop the bait. Click on the video on your screen to find out more about how fish gum works or click the second video for the top 5 tips for surf fishing. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and as always, thanks for watching.